What is up YouTube? What is up? Hope you guys are enjoying this beautiful Monday. We got a good Monday here. Get this stuff set up for you guys. We got a good Monday. Today is February. I'm lying. Today is January 18th. Um, Martin Luther King Day. You know, so salute to MLK. Junior, salute to MLK. Senior, salute to, um, you know, salute to the history. You know, salute to the history. If you don't know your history, just do your, do your, do your research. Do your research. It, sh it should have been top to us. It should have been top to us. I don't know if it was or not. But uh, today's video, we're going to be talking about Chime. We're going to be talking about, um, we got Chime. We got TurboTax. Jackson Hewitt. Today was the official day for the direct deposits. So if you guys receive your direct deposits, drop the comments below. If you guys are receiving your mail checks over the weekend, drop the comments below. I have a lot of people commenting. A lot of people reached out to me and said, hey, I received my direct, uh, so I received my a mail check, but at the IRS portal, they lied to me and said that I'm receiving a direct deposit or there's no update at all. So I want you guys to know that just because the IRS portal says either nothing or something doesn't mean it's 100 percent accurate as i mentioned before in my other videos the irs portal is seems to be outdated not updated but outdated they seem to like update like once a week you know so and it seems like they don't even know what's going on you know they may say hey we mailed out a check and then people receive direct deposits or they may say direct deposit and you get mailed out a check so you we really don't know at this point nobody even knows i don't think the irs knows what's going on i don't think turbo tax knows what's going on i don't think chime knows what's going on i really don't know anybody i think they know what's going on really because at the end of the day you have turbo tax blaming the irs the irs blaming turbo tax they're blaming donald trump they're blaming this person so it's a bunch of confusion everywhere you know nobody's really giving an official update on what's going on like it's you may be able to check the irs portal and you may still see an update from january 8th you know it's like it's it's been a week you know it's literally been a week and there still has been no update today was a direct deposit day so hopefully today was a good day for you guys if you guys have received your direct deposit today drop the comments below and if you haven't still drop the comments below you know i know today is a holiday and that was one thing i was confused about was how are they doing direct deposits on a holiday where the banks are closed, you know? And I thought, okay, well maybe, maybe they issued it on Friday and maybe it took some time to process over the weekend. So there's guests like Monday, like Monday. So that's what I was thinking. But you know, I don't know. I really don't know why would they say this direct deposit day? Cause they needed all that information by the 15th, the 16th, and then the direct deposits was gonna go on Monday. Now they did say it was gonna be direct deposit January 18th. Now I'm starting to think maybe they're just starting the process January 18th. You know, maybe I'm coming to my own conclusions like at this point, nobody knows what's going on. You know, at this point they're blaming each other. You know, we have millions, millions of Americans without money, without food, without transportation, you know what I mean? Without the expenses they need, you know, bills are on top of bills, on bills packing, um, piling up. So like at this point, I, it's just like a joke to them. You know, it's a joke to me, I should say. It's a joke to me, like this is not even, like what can we do? Like really, like why, why are they, Number one, not even knowing what's going on. You know, like I said, you can check the IRS portal. If you guys have, let me know what to say. You know, some people's IRS portal actually says that they received something through their Chime account. And then, like I said, I get comments and they're talking about it's already received. But when they talk to Chime, they say nothing's been in there. So it's like, what is really going on? You know, with the IRS portals, with the accounts, you know, I understand there's obviously some type of confusion that nobody knows about. Nobody knows about, so I really hope that they can actually fix this issue, you know, and I don't really think there's not going to be a fix for this issue because people are going to be still receiving their direct deposits, people are going to still be receiving their mail checks, and they can still check the IRS portal, and it still will say it's on the way or there's no update, you know, so you guys just be careful and keep an eye out for your mail, keep an eye out for all your accounts as well because at this point, I really think it will drop at any time now. At any time it will drop at this point, you know, you got TurboTax, if you got Chime, they were supposed to release all of that information. I mean, now they were supposed to release all of the direct deposits uh, about two weeks ago. So if you guys have either of those banks, you know, drop the comments below as well. But they were supposed to release 
all of the direct deposits and mailing checks by last week. You know, by law, I think they have it to like the end of the month. So no matter what's going on, just know we have until at least the end of the month. And then if not, the people who have not received any direct deposits, any mail-in checks will have to claim on their taxes. So they will have to actually do that reimbursement on their taxes. And I know that's a long way. That's about two months from now. But at this rate, at least that's a definite way of no matter what's going on right now, everybody will still be able to get their check and get it in They're secured no matter what. At this point, I don't think anybody knows what's going on. You know, I really don't. You know, I mean, I'm not, I don't fully still understand what's going on, you know, just like everybody else, you know, there's millions of people that's been affected. So guys, don't be like scared or don't be like, hey, am I the only one affected? It's thousands, it's millions of people, you know, thousands of people around you, but there's millions of people that have been affected by this. So, and I just want to give you guys an update of nothing right now, you know what I mean? There's nothing right now, but they're saying today was the day of the January 18th was supposed to be direct deposits. So guys, check your accounts you know what i mean and at this point if you got to contact TurboTax, contact chime contact jackson hewitt contact all of these places just to make sure and figure out what's going on you know what i mean try to get the best update as possible and i know and i understand like these companies are basically giving out general information these little fake responses you know not really meaning anything you know so at the end of the day Check the portals, like contact TurboTax. If you guys got to contact Chime, Jackson Hewitt, Chase, Huntington, all these places, figure out where your money at, you know what I mean? But at the, but as I mentioned, today was supposed to be the direct deposit day. I'm still trying to give it hope. I'm still trying to give the IRS and the government the benefit of the doubt. You know, they, they're the ones that mention these dates. You know, they're putting down dates. And at this point, that's all we can go off of. You know, whether they're playing with us or not, that's all that we can go off. As I mentioned, today is January 18th, so this is the latest update. And if you guys got any other day updates or if you guys received any other information today, drop the comments below. I am still doing a giveaway at the end of the month. All you have to do is like this video, subscribe, turn notifications on, and then like every video you see of mine and drop a comment stating that you want to be entered in the giveaway. I'm going to enter you in the giveaway. I will write down your name, put your name in a basket, in a hat, pull the name out. If you win, I'll probably do like a gift card. We might do like Amazon, but PayPal, you know, Cash App, something like that, you know. Um, if you guys got any questions, drop the comments below as well. Stay loyal, stay blessed, stay true, stay true.